Hi, it's Tati. Today we're going to be doing panning. One is with Eshig, which you need the Sapphire plugin, but I think I'll have it in the description. Um, this one is more shaky than the other one. First, we're going to learn the one with Eshig. Now, the thing is, with this one, I don't have specific settings, so I made a preset. I don't know what it, like, I don't know if it works for specific after effects versions and i don't even know if it works period so you'll have to test that out but i tried to help so i don't really know why i gave you a preset i was just feeling fun the amplitude i use 0 0.150 and the frequency i use six and then i leave the rest alone but click motion blur <laughs> this is the part where it gets a little blurry because i don't use the same settings and I barely use S shake to begin with. I think it's something like maybe 85 for X shake and then for the Y shake maybe 45. I keep doing fives it just feels right and then tilt shake five <laughs> and it might look really bad so you have to mess with all three of these you'll be fine. It doesn't look that bad it's kind of fast. I don't know how you can like do the speed you might want to mess with amplitude if it's too crazy for you but yeah now we're gonna do the actual panic so you look up wiggle but there's two versions of wiggle that i use and that's wiggle position and wiggle rotation but we're gonna work on wiggle position first so the wiggle speed i keep at one but the wiggle amount i put at five and then for wiggle rotation i keep the wiggle speed at one again but for the wiggle amount i put it at three and i change this every so often because the rotation can be a bit much sometimes but it looks fine here so if you want to watch this edit with the sound you can follow my instagram and if you want you can subscribe to my channel and follow my instagram that would be cool but until then i will return next week